I'm Kelly Warner. Most cancer cases have no exact known cause, but about 5 to 10 percent occur due to a genetic abnormality. At Willamette Valley Cancer Institute, physicians are helping patients and their relatives lower their risk of getting cancer by offering them an opportunity to better understand their family tree. And they're bringing that expertise to patients in the form of telegenetics. Okay, Lisa, this is Genevieve. Hi, Genevieve. Hi, Lisa. Genevieve White is having a unique appointment at Willamette Valley Cancer Institute. She's meeting with genetic counselor Lisa Clark to find out if she's at a higher risk for certain cancers. I'm the first one in three generations of my family to survive colon cancer. Genevieve is in Eugene, while Lisa is in Portland. Through a partnership between WVCI and sister company, Compass Oncology, Lisa and Genevieve are utilizing interactive video and a secure high-speed connection for a virtual appointment. Well, I think this is excellent that you can do it on a video conference like this. I don't have to go to Portland or run off somewhere. As a genetic counselor, Lisa is trained to help identify inheritable mutations that exist in a family and recommend testing when appropriate. And because these are passed down generation to generation, we want to see if there's something going on, not only for yourself, but for your family members. Yes. If it's suspected that a patient may have a hereditary component to their cancer, oncologists like Dr. Miho Doherty often suggest genetic testing. And if we can figure out you know, who may be at risk, then we can screen them better and maybe prevent the cancers from happening. Based on Genevieve's family history of cancer, Lisa suspects she may carry a genetic mutation, which increases the risk of colon and gynecological cancers. Genevieve wants to know for sure, so she's chosen to undergo a simple blood test that will offer more concrete answers and potentially help protect her family and herself down the road. Since WVCI began offering telegenetics to its patients in July, Genevieve is the 12th patient to use the service. The cost of genetic testing is spendy, about $4,000. If patients meet the criteria for testing, insurance will typically pay for it, but there may be some out-of-pocket cost. I'm Kelly Warner.